Hi everyone, Pet Elizabeth here. Welcome back to my channel. I'm coming on today with another DIY to share with you all. And it's another wall art. So this wall art that I'm doing, I seen in um, Z Gallery and in some other stores. I've seen it and I really like how it looks, yeah. So, but I added my own twist to it. You know, I always take things as I see, add my own touch to it. So I'm coming on today to share with you my version of the wall art that I see online. Yeah, and if you're new to my channel, I hope you will press the subscribe button and ring the bell so you get notified every time I upload another DIY to share with you all. And if you're one of my returning subscribers, Thank you very much. I really appreciate you <laughs> for every time you see my video, you click on it and show me some love and support. I really do appreciate it. <laughs> All right, everyone, let's get into the items that we'll be using for today's DIY. Alright everyone, we're going to start with our canvas and we're going to be using the silver acrylic paint and we're going to paint our canvas with one coat of our silver paint and the canvas you guys is 18 by 24. Next we have this mirror from the Dollar Tree, just their round mirror. I took it out the frame and the back of the mirror I placed on top of the mirror. So I'm going to be using some crushed glass and some <laughs> and some Mod Podge <laughs> and I'm just gonna go right around the mirror that's left out with the Mod Podge and then that's where we're gonna be placing our crushed glass and when everything is dry I'm gonna go over with another layer of Mod Podge and then I'll also be adding some silver glitter with it so it will dry <laughs> just one coat of the silver glitter going all the way around and now that our mirror is all dry we'll be placing it on our canvas which our canvas is dry also and I'll be just using some E6000 and some hot glue to place it down Now I'll be using some hot glue to draw some lines coming down our canvas going all the way around. And now that our canvas is all dry, I'll be using some more crushed glass with the Mod Podge and we are going to just follow the lines going all the way down and adding our crushed glass with the lines. Now I was going to use glitter in this step everyone. I wasn't going to put the crushed glass, I was going to use glitter because the designs that I've seen it with in the gallery, it looks like it's glitter they use, some paint and glitter. But I'm changing mine up and I'm using the crushed glass, yeah. So for this step, you don't really have to use the glue gun to draw the lines. You can draw the lines yourself with a pencil if you like. Or you could use the glue gun like I did. Either one will be fine. But you do need the lines to help you place down the crushed glass. Now 
Next, I'll be mixing some small glitter with the Mod Podge and then placing it following the lines going down on the canvas. Now I'll be using some large glitter just around the top part of the canvas. And here's our finished look. I like how it turned out. I seen this design on, where did I say, Z Gallery? Yeah, I seen it online and I like how they did it so I added my own twist to it to make it my own. I added the mirror and then I added the crushed glass going down. And I think it turned out very nice. I like how it looks. <laughs> now I placed it here in my living room and I'm just wondering if it's a little, mm, if it looks nice there on the wall with the other wall decors. I want you to tell me if you think it fits right in or if it looks too crowded on the wall. I want to hear your opinion on this one. As you can see here, here's everything going around. And I did do all these DIYs myself. Yes, I did. All right, everyone. So as you can see, here is, as you can see, here is the wall art. I think it looks very nice. And the contrast between the other two, I'm not sure, but like I said, give me your opinion, tell me what you think, if it's okay on the wall <laughs> with all of them here. Let me turn the camera so you can see that one a little better. Yeah, there's that one there, once again, there they all are. So tell me what you think. Leave it up there. Do you think it looks okay? Does it fit right in? Or is it a little too much? And I should try and place it somewhere else. <laughs> Leave your comment down below and tell me what you think. A little decorating ideas. Tell me what you think about it. And yeah, so that would be your comment. To tell me what you think. If I should leave it up or put it somewhere else throughout my home if the wall is too crowded or if it's okay give me your opinion I would really appreciate it and thank you so much for coming on and seeing this DIY that I did for today <laughs> and remember as always stay blessed <laughs> from Petal is blessed bye bye everyone <laughs> When I had you, I was say okay. I need you beside me. Yeah, girl, I need you beside me. Yeah, you, 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 you beside me.